Hello, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> um, I'm only joking. So happy new year. Cannot believe it's 2023 and I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas. We had such a nice time. I went home with Carl and the three doggies and we just had a ball. Like we saw all our family and friends and had such a nice time. So um, yeah, and then we came back, New Year's party. And then my dad was here with his partner and it was all just a bit manic, but it was like busy, but like happy around family kind of manic. Um, and I love being around people and being busy. So it was the perfect Christmas for me. And uh, yeah, then came back and kind of got all the decorations down, getting refreshed. And yes, yeah, so I'm going to do this vlog is going to be kind of like a few different deliveries I'm having over the next day or two. Today is Thursday. I think it's the 5th of January. And I'm also going to just include like what I'm doing in terms of sort of just trying to start a few healthier habits. Nothing like hardcore. Um, went back to boxing last night. And I'm really aching like my muscles. What the hell? Um, and also I've signed up to an IBS course, which I'm really looking forward to because let me tell you, my stomach is in bits after eating all that food. So, um, yeah, can't wait for that. I don't know why I just did that. But anyway, let's get cracking. I'm going to start off with like this morning, starting some food and um, show you a few deliveries. Hint, here's one of them. And we will go from there and see where this vlog goes. Good morning. It is the 5th of January and I'm starting to catch little videos of what I'm going up to um getting back into a normal routine so I've just made my breakfast this is um 40 grams of oats with flaxseed and also I made it with almond milk and I've added some frozen raspberries so it's my first time trying it with the almond milk I'll let you know what I think I've had a giant H&M delivery so I'm gonna open it up and get trying it on I'm really excited to see what's in here because yeah, I just had a bit of a 2am order, which always goes well. God, I look like an absolute state. I can't believe that I am recording myself here like this. But anyway, um, the dog bed that I ordered, obviously for the dogs, has arrived. And I'd open it. When we were in England, the dogs absolutely adored the one that my mum has for her dogs. Dog, even. So I thought I'd get them one. And I've tried to get one that's bigger. Um, for all of them. Oh, I don't know why I'm doing this with wire cutters. Carl will kill me if he sees me doing this, but look. <clears throat> so the interesting thing is going to be whether it actually does fit all three dogs. It's kind of been packed down really small. I hope. We went back with khaki colour. Oh, it's been vacuum packed. I've never had a delivery that's vacuum packed. Right, I'll open it up. Here is the dog bed. It kind of looks like the dogs. They might, oh my God, they're gonna like blend in. They're gonna blend into the dog bed. <laughs> this looks like a giant cavaboo. Right, let's get it on the floor and try it. I've literally just put it on the floor and Poppy is already. <laughs> she went straight to the dog bed. Let's see if I can put my other little nugget in there. Poppy might growl at him a bit. so cute do you think we can get one more it's a bit of a tight squeeze isn't it oh my god Barney do you want to have a go darling come on okay 
Okay, maybe not three. <laughs> That's it. Lie down, bun. <gasps> Good boy. Chester. Poppy. Into bed. <gasps> Go on. Sit down. Lie down, pops. <gasps> oh, you're the cutest little doggies in the land. Oh, yes, you are. <laughs> oh my god, I can't cope. They love the bed. Okay, they're in their absolute element and they're snoozing on their new bed. It's supposed to be really good for like calming them. That's why I thought I'd get it. God, they look snug as a little bug. Bless their little hearts. Right, I want to just quickly try on these H&M pieces. I am not going to like style them in the outfits that I'd wear them with because it will just take me forever and it just causes carnage every time I do that. There is clothes everywhere. Um, but I just thought I'd literally just put them on and show you them in my living room. Okay, so first one on and I love it already. This is like a black and white, it's kind of a creamy color cardigan, which is giving me real like, designer vibes but it was so cheap this is all from H&M by the way um I ordered a size large in this one which is like a nice size because it's not too tight but it's not too uh small either um and it was $22.99 and then I got $4.99 off so I'll let you do the maths um yeah I really enjoy it it'll be really nice like as I'm wearing it or you can wear it with like leather leggings little black skirt so yes, like that one. Next up, I have got this fleece hoodie and it's in, I think this is the dark grey. They've got a few different colours and I have actually ordered the second colour because it is crazy how cheap it is. I think this was like 12 euros or not even that. Um, and then I had a few little vouchers on the app. Um, so you can apply two to an order. So I think I've ordered the cream one for six euros. Um, it's got like a nice little half zip and it's like the nicest like velvety material and it's got a hood I love it this is a size large and I think that's like the right size for me it's not I didn't want it skin tight but I didn't want it too oversized um yes perfect next up I got this it's like a jacquard pattern I think and it's got like a wide sleeve, which is really nice. Um, it's not too boxy. Um, it kind of just hangs with the shape of your body. And I think this was 22 euros reduced right down. I bought a size medium in this one because uh, lots of people said that it was quite oversized and I'm glad I did. Um, you can see there's like a good bit of room in it. But it's so cozy. I think it'd be really cute with like my little fur coat. Happy with this one. Next up, I really wanted a nice raincoat, um, but just like a lightweight one because I always get so hot when I'm out walking the dogs. So for this one, this is an oversized, what do you call that? Like a nice check. It's got a hood on it as well. Hood's a good size. And it's got a little bag that you can put it in as well. And it was literally reduced down to 20 quid. Um, I choose, yeah, ch choose? I chose to go for the medium in this one because the re reviews were saying like it was oversized, as I was saying. Um, so moment of truth, what do I think? What do I think? I've got quite a thick jumper underneath now. Oh, I think I like it. Like it's obviously fairly like boxy, but because I've sized down, not too boxy and it's like it's not too tight oh, I'm actually delighted with that yes now this last one actually I've got I think I've got one more maybe not um is an oversized shacket let me tell you this is incredible quality um this is I think it's called like dark beige um, it's got lovely, like, soft lining inside. Love the pockets. Oh. And, uh, yeah, double pockets. Nice, like, smart 
collar, which I think is really nice when you've got broad shoulders and it's like on the shoulder as well. It's not like hanging down. Um, I went for the medium in this because it is oversized, which I'm glad I, I did. And it kind of, it hits, yeah, it does cover your bum as well. It's really nice fabric. It's like a soft kind of felty feel to it. And this was reduced down from 50 quid. I think it was, I need to stop doing that. <laughs> um, I think it was 23, because it was 49.99 with 23 off. Oh, sorry, so 26, I think. Um, oversized jacket, dark beige. And I think it looks so smart, but also really cozy. So I love, I love it. Okay, then this, excuse my hair, is the last one. This is the light beige knitted polo dress i think anyway the one that a lot of people have been raving about this wasn't on sale this is the only thing that wasn't on sale it's 39.99 in euros um it's really soft i like the color i like the fit I like the detail around here and the roll neck is really cozy um you could probably do that a bit better if you wanted to i've just thrown it on and i wouldn't obviously wear it with jeans but i'm not going to show you my little pasty legs i think the I think the length is okay. I'm quite tall, I'm 5'8". Um, so I think it will be all right with tights. Yeah, no butt will be revealed. Um, and yeah, I went for a large in this one because a lot of people were saying that it's like quite true to size, which I would say it is. I just personally prefer mine. Like I wouldn't want mine kind of snug like that. I prefer it a bit looser. So I'm happy with that sizing. And it is really, it's really, really soft. That is the last of my order and I'm really happy. I think I'm gonna keep everything. Um, let me know what you think. Do you like the pieces I picked up? I'm actually going for a dog walk in a minute. So I'm gonna wear this fleece jumper. It is like 12 euros. You cannot go wrong. It's so cozy. And I think they do have still, do still have some sizes. I'm gonna wear this and I'm gonna put my little raincoat over the top. dog walk but keep it fashionable because I'm so fashionable obviously tuck that in oh yes I'm gonna wear my black chunky boots cute 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 super tootsy I love the color of this and the pattern and it's really thin so I won't be sweating there we go my friend is coming in literally a minute to go for our dog walk. And honestly, trying to get the dogs ready and out the door is such a stressful experience. Right, I have to do Poppy first, because she gets so, oh my God, she'll start like, they'll start whining as soon as I get the leads out. Stop, they'll go absolutely eight. Every time we leave the house, there is this big dramatic scene. Poppy, I think you are in love. Right, that's you. Chesty Poo. And Barney, all the while, is just sat out of the way because he doesn't like having his coat put on. But he loves when it's on. Mind, guys. Oh, these are the little coats that I bought when I was in England for Christmas. They were only three. Oh, Barney's obviously very. He's a very good boy. These were only three ninety nine from was it Home Bargains or B and M. Which one was it? Which one was it? I think it was B&M. Yeah, it was B&M. So, come here, baby. There we go. We're all dressed for our dog walk. I put my little raincoat on. Also, I got these socks for Christmas. I'm very flexible, obviously, as you can see. And um, trying to trim the dog. These are the Nike. <laughs> I'm too close. Dry fit, I think they're called ones. 
and they come in like this pack of the most beautiful neutral colors and beiges and i love having a pair of socks for every outfit so um yeah there we go right, let's get me a new coat where's my new coat a new coat guys go for a little walk with my friend oh there's the little bag look very cute and we get outside we're never ready when the rain comes so we need to get ourselves ready on time in fact i think she's late you know chesty poo poo look at little chester he's getting so so tall and his um adult coat coat is coming through underneath i'll show you after but yeah let's go for a walk Esther has just run up the stairs with his lead and pulled all the poo bags out. Come here, come here, come here. <laughs> I found like a one credit that the Christmas part went like quick, quick, quick. It did. Chester has discovered <coughs> a bar. <coughs> Chester! <coughs> Chester! <coughs> um, also, I am eating some hot rolls with Christmas leftovers because. I hate waste and everything in moderation. I've just been for a good walk. I had a really healthy breakfast. So now I'm going to finish off the Christmas stuff. I'm just finishing up work soon for the day. I'm actually, I have been sat on the sofa because um, I've had quite a lot of video calls today, but like, sorry, not video calls, <sighs> uh, calls, but ones where I could, ju I just needed to kind of sit and listen. So I just wanted to do that somewhere comfortable. Um, yeah, I think my work is going to get busy, busy, busy. Um, but I was coming on because, oh my God, I was just adding the last few clips to my little video for my vlog. And when I, I didn't notice that when I was getting the dogs ready for the walk, Chester was like humping puppy. I'm so sorry for that absolute porn on my stories, my stories on my videos. That's disgraceful. Anyway. Just kidding. Um, I've booked the dogs in for their full groom um, on the 20th of Jan and Chess is going to have his first full groom. So I'm nervous, but I can't wait to see them. Um, but yeah, I'm going to finish up soon and sort of maybe tidy up a bit. And then I've got a gym class at seven. Carl's gone to work in his granddad's pub tonight. So I've got a night by myself. <laughs> Might do some like Instagram admin stuff that I need to do. Um, I've done a fair bit of that today at lunchtime. I need to do some more like emails and things like that. So yes, I'm off to the gym. I've got my new gym leggings on from Amazon, which I really love. They're so stretchy. And I'm going for the brown socks over the top look with Carl's t-shirt. Tell me it's January without telling me it's January. <laughs> okay, I'm back from the gym. I made myself a little pep tea. I've had my, sorry, I've had my dinner had a nice shower, washed my hair, which I was really dying to do. Now I've made a Pepti and I'm going to have some of these little leftovers because I'm just moderately phasing out Christmas, okay? Um, moderately, slowly, whatever the word is that I'm thinking of. So that's it. I'm going to go and sit on the sofa. I have lost my hairbrush, can you tell? Um, This is my new throw that I got in... Home bargains. I keep mixing up home bargains and BM. But um this is the darker one. I got it in two colours and I freaking love it. So I'm using it as like a little blanket as well. Um yeah, so I actually am going to finish the vlog today because um sorry, I literally have no idea. I've just got straight out of the shower. Hopefully I'm presentable. Um because I want to do a weekend one of like just pottering about and we'll be able to pottering, sorry. So, um, yeah, I'm going to finish it tonight. I know there's not been a lot in there, but at least you'll get to see the H&M bits. And yeah, on my Instagram stories, I've started sharing um, like when I'm just making random food. Now, I am not a food blogger and I never will be and I know nothing, but I enjoy doing it. So if I make something nice, I might share it on here one day if that will be all right um let me know what you think i know lots of people like getting little food ideas and i tend to might make quite sort of random things so i could do that 
Um, this weekend we want to, well, I would like to sort the like hangover from Christmas. The middle bedroom needs to get straight because I'm gonna lose my marbles. Um, it is just, it's all over the place. Um, bits left over in there. So I want to get stuff back up into the loft and sort of get organized. And I want to properly style places around the home because um, I actually just haven't had a chance to do that. I've still got out quite a lot of my Christmas foliage. So I want to change up some of my vases so I could come on and do that. Um, I'm gonna get some new content for Instagram and go on like nice long walk, you know, just no spend, organizing, satisfying, pamper weekend, I think is on the cards. And then I've got something really exciting, maybe happening the weekend after. Um, and as soon as I know more about that, I will definitely share because I'm really, really looking forward to it. If it's all going ahead, fingers crossed. Um, I also want to talk about some of the little projects and things that we've got going on or that I'm planning for this year. Um, but I might just save that for chats over the weekend, you know? Um, nothing too groundbreaking. Um, that's all really. I'm just going to stop waffling now and I will catch up with you and let you know what we get up to at the weekend. So goodbye.